about to do valuetainment. As you guys can see, headquarters. And, uh, oh, well, I still got a, just ring the doorbell. You probably got a call. Hey, look, guys, for all you guys that say I'm not black, I got monster watermelon. Oh, jeez, here we go. <laughs> horrible black <Monster> jokes. <laughs> Wait, uh, oh, and by the way, do you see how I look? Oh. 10 calories. 10 calories? All right. Hey, how are you? How's it going? Good, how are you? Chilling, chilling. Come on in. All right, sorry. Let's get you in there. Shit it. Three. One, two, one, two. But I go live right now. One, two, one, two. Okay. And then Jorge, you there? Turn me up just a little. Turn me up Ready, just bro? A, a little bit. Yeah. Ready for this? And and Myron Gaines, can you turn me down a bit as well? Turn me up on my headphones. Turn me up on my headphones. What's the topic? Um, I mean, this is more <laughs> graphic design, production. And then upstairs, we've got an entire like sales department that is going to be moving in that, because uh, Patrick does a lot of business consulting. We've got... Um, okay. You guys should probably... If you can, we can figure out some time to spend some time with Pat. Yeah, no, that'd be awesome. And, that'd be dope. Um, and that'd just kind of get on a business wavelength because yeah. basically, for sure, you know, that's... He, I don't know. If Pat's sad, he's going to be around. He just kind of over their business model. How much value do you think that would bring? We got her dog. Oh, Auntie the Vapor. We got a dancing comedian. Hey. Okay. Okay, Issa. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. She ain't playing. There you go. All right, let's get ass. We got Shay here, man. Okay, Shay. Okay, Tommy. You already know, just fresh off the plot from Dubai. Fine. Oh, shit. Stop playing with her. And I didn't go to be a human party. Huh? Oh, oh, big time. Shout out to Tommy here, man. I'm going to Dubai, and I'm not going to do that either. <laughs> you going? You going, man? I'm going to make money. Okay, so, so yeah. I'm, I'm never in, so I'm hoping I have a good time. Oh, you will. I'll tell you where to go. I literally... I'm not drunk. I'm dead ass not drunk. You dead ass Shay. drunk. I'm not stupid. drunk. I promise to God. That weed too tight and you need a different God kind of glue. God knows I'm right. not drunk right Chris, uh, now. God dumb knows. son of a bitch. Just up in no, the bitch. You're in dumb. for no reason. No, no, no. He not finna try to play me on Who's the Who's you, stupid you? bitch? No, bitch. You fucking stupid. Nobody's bitch. drunk. Your no. Get off me. Whoa, whoa. 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 I got tired of seeing it. And I want to just say the one that got to me, the one that made me unfollow you was the one that it was the one with the, the the lady that had the wig or something like that and i guess you know which one i'm talking about i don't because i'm all, i talk about <laughs> ladies and wigs a lot so i was like what exactly the and they're all black so it's just like <laughs> it's just like um, it's just like like i was cool you know i was really cool everything but what what was why, it on there that bothered you what um, was it about that post it was um specifically you were saying something about um I guess uh, she was playing you or something. Somebody that reported your page. I don't really know. I don't follow you about a week ago, so I really don't remember. It was around my dad's death, but I didn't want to see it on my TL because I'm like, damn, Tommy, Like I thought you was better than that. Better than what? Well, okay. I, I, was, I explain it to people like this. One, I don't understand why black women get to tell a black man because you're black, you can't talk about the, this group. When no, the, what, you can't. Well, well, hold on. If you, want me, if you go to ESPN, you're going to get sports. You're not going to get politics. You're going to get sports. So when people come to me, they're going to hear me talk about what I think is the problem. Okay. I think we have a lot of issues, and I think they are starting with the idea of our women. So I will speak on that. Now, you can mm -hmm. go to another guy and hear him tell, young Pharaoh tell you about how black women are God and then cheat on y'all and beat you. You can go hear that if you want. Mm -hmm. But I think it's odd that you're willing to listen to somebody tell you how great you are and you kings and queens and how you're the most beautiful thing on the earth. But you're not listening to somebody say the other side. It's the same thing I was saying on the discussion. Why not hear more than one side? So you can go to somebody else and hear them tell you all the things that make you feel good. Mm -hmm. But if you come to me, I'm going to tell you the opposite. Because why do you need to hear that? And the last thing is, I grew up in a family. And most of us grew up around black folks. If you grew up with a black mom, a black grandma, or a black aunt, it's funny how we listen to those who, talk, who supposedly love us 
talk to us and say, sit your black ass down. Don't do this. Slap you when you get. You mm -hmm. can listen to your mama who had you talk to that way, but not a guy who you don't know who you could simply unfollow. That lets me know mm -hmm. a lot of people are soft. I can follow someone and I will argue not you're black. So you can't talk about blacks. I'll say, does what you say have merit? Mm -hmm. I don't care if a white person's talking about blacks. Because here's what's funny. You don't want a black man to talk about black women. But if a white woman did it, would you listen to that? Nope. Uh, no. You say she was racist. If anybody else did So who can talk about it? So my problem, my, well, I ain't going to say problem. My whole debate is why only you only target black? Like, I'm pretty sure white but that's people who I get know. on you too. Uh -uh, Dominican that's who I know. people get on you too. Uh -uh. Why you don't, why you don't uh, um, say because something don't. about them? When I say Come white women, because when I, every race I don't get listen, on your no. ass, when I, say, when I say white women got flat, I did a whole song about white women and they flat we ass. We ain't talking about <laughs> you. We're talking about your <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Uh, when I say something about white people, they eat it. Yeah, because he's black. They eat it. I can get up in the front of a comedy set, and I've done it several times, made fun of the white people in the audience. They, <laughs> they eat it. They're mm -hmm. not sitting around wearing their emotions on their shoulders, and white men don't go around talking about some call me king because we created the earth. There's only <laughs> one group of people who keep giving themselves false praise. You want to get mad that somebody's talking about somebody wearing a Okay, wig. but we should have every right to feel that we You can, can and I have every exactly. right to say what I... But listen exactly. to what you just said. Yeah, I don't go you, to you other people's stuff. You should know style. our background. No, but... I, Yes, so if I would exactly. speak on it so because we I have every right yeah, to yeah, feel that way. I, I speak on it because I know the background. So if you can go on your stuff and talk about how great you are, and I don't go on there and tell you you can't, mm -hmm. why would you follow me, mm. see what I say, then come tell me what I can't say when you said you can say what you want? That's true, though. I always say this. Black women love to say how strong they are. Mm -hmm. If you're really strong... Other people's opinion shouldn't bother you that much. It don't bother you. You're the, you're the most un, you're the most bothered, you unbothered talk about people your on own earth. Race? They're not listen. See what you're saying? Why would you want to talk about your own race? But if I sit there and say how great they were, you wouldn't say. Why would you want to talk about your own exactly. race? So all I, I can do is big up a group of people. I wouldn't. So I wouldn't. all I can do is big up a group of people. You got to go to somebody else. Go to another dude who talked. Hold on, hold on. How, this is how we're gonna fucking do this shit. You're gonna shut the fuck up until they're done saying what they gotta say. No stupid ass interjection. I told you guys that, that shit from the beginning of the show. Everyone will get their piece, okay? I see you that you got something to say. Let her finish her piece. Shay, stop fucking interjecting because I stopped them when you were trying to talk, okay? So let her finish her piece. I'll turn it back to you and I'll let Tommy talk as well. If we're going to have a podcast, one mic at a fucking time. Not going to hurt the show quality for some bullshit right here with your emotions. So finish your piece and then we'll uh, switch it over to you and then you. Go ahead, please. No, but just saying that, you know, you guys fall for all this equality. There was a girl the other day that she went to school and she was for mathematics or something and then didn't cheat her right in the class. Women, stop getting emotional. When you want to be in this game, there's no emotion in it, okay? So learn how to debate. We really need debate class back in school so that people learn how to argue without taking it personally. Yeah. And if you do feel like something is personal to you, you know how to... Um, throw it back in a more intellectual way instead of having to stand up like a woman be aggressive to a man when women are supposed to be feminine and not masculine it doesn't make sense i watch your, your show for a long time and i've seen a lot of women Thanks. act out but then later yes. on want to be like oh but i want a man that's 10 um six foot ten that makes a lot of money and blah 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 you're not gonna get a man acting like a man Ooh. Damn. Okay. So, uh, all done. right. So I'll turn it back to. Uh, I know you had something. Uh, sh uh, go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead, Jussie. I know you had some. Um. So my quick little comment because I, I think she's getting further into the video. Because at this point, there's no really. To me, what I've seen so far, there's no really line of disrespect. There. I think they're just both out of altercation, of not miscommunication and.